This is my intro song. It isn't very long. That's all. Go ahead. Go on, watch the video. What it is, uh, what's up? You can do it all by yourself. Let me see you do it. Hey, let me see you do it. Hey, my lovely Diamond Cubs. I'm sorry, we just celebrating today because it is my hubby's Leo birthday today. So we celebrating in this very cute nails household, honey. But anyway, lovely Diamond Cubs, welcome back. If you're new here, subscribe and let's check out this video. My beautiful Diamond Cubs, welcome, welcome back. As you can see, we are going right into the application. Kiss, kiss. Um, I hope all of you are doing fabulous. All the new people here, I really wish you well. I hope you are doing amazing. Thank you for stopping by. Um, however you found this page, I'm so glad you did. And I hope you consider subscribing to be a member of this beautiful family that we've collab you know, got together. Um, and if you are a returning Diamond Cub, you know, a my A1 game, one, game ones, y'all know I love y'all. I appreciate you so much for commenting. For those that, you know, are able to share my videos, I really appreciate it. Thank you so, so much. As you can see, we are doing some under the sea nails based on the title. Um, I'm going in with this Forever Beauty color, this beautiful blue. Now, remember, I am new. <laughs> I am a beginner. I am in no way an expert. Um, this day also, I was, it was so hot, child, and I was struggling, but, you know, it is what it is. Um, like this part right here. Eventually, I leave like this little crack on this side. I was just like, huh, all right, I'm gonna leave it. I felt like I was just trusting the process. So, you know, we're just gonna let this video play out. You know, I love how at least the acrylic lays. It lays beautifully, even if it dries fast. And it has such a beautiful color. And I love using this size 14 Kiara Skoy brush. But anyway, so today we're doing some under the sea nails. Um, I feel like my one thing that I have issue with when it comes to these long nails is the filing and the shaping. The application, of course, is a big thing. But, you know, I'm going to get there. I'm going to keep practicing. So I'm going to let y'all just chill see what we got going on.
I think these colors go so well together. This is blue and this purple. It's so beautiful. Beautiful. All right, so um, again, I'm, I'm trying to get into and practice marbling. I've seen different ways and different people do it different ways. I'm trying to come up with my own little strategy, I guess. Um, that first little layer you saw, I painted it very, very thin. So I'm trying to just, you know, get a little bit of bulk on top and as well as making sure that I get some good color. Um, I'm not using this that much for strength. I'm going to be capping this one. But um, this acrylic is very strong. So it's not like a color acrylic that doesn't have any, you know, strength behind it. But, you know, I feel like it came out all right for a little beginner marble. <laughs> All right. So last minute, I was like, you know what? I feel like this going to need a little bit of pop of something. So um, right at the end of this, I was like, all right, I think I'm going to need something. So I got the white acrylic and I got a wet bead and I just laid it across the top. And this video is a little scattered. <laughs> so what we're going to come up on the next scene is going to be after filing and all that stuff um which obviously like i said i'm not the best at but i'm trying you know sometimes this condition or you know this mixed connective tissue thing that i have it, you know it's a little rough on the hands so anyway as you can see i got some silver swirls going on they could have been thinner they could have been cleaner um, I know for next time, you know, I'll definitely, that, that this is with a liner um, bottle instead of like a liner brush. So like a liner that comes as a liner, you know, that little thin brush at the top. Still didn't get that thin of a line. I think probably because it's glitter. But um, yeah, I did some little random things. I took a little bit of this glitter, glitter, glitter acrylic. And I put that in the little missing gap that was on the thumb and just did some little swirls, added some stickers of jellyfish and other fun things. And I'm using my Forever Beauty base and top coat to get that gorgeous shine, honey.
All right, so now we out the lamp. We put some top coat on the top and bottom. And here you go, boot, boot. I don't like to toot my own horn, but toot, toot. Tooty, toot, toot, toot. Now I know the shape is not necessarily the best, <laughs> but I feel like I did very well for it being my first extra long coffin set. So thank you so much for watching. I appreciate it to all my lovely diamond cubs. Thank you so much. Here are the colors and codes for the Forever Beauty products that I'm using. Um, here's the extremely white that I used and their top and base coat. For all the new people that are around, thank you so much for checking out the video. Definitely subscribe and stay very cute. I love y'all sending all the to y'all, pushing out that love and light to you as always. Peace.